What's up everyone? NF Fishing here. We are here at Lower Highland Lake up in Goshen, Massachusetts. Just doing some uh, early fall fishing. Got a little uh, rattle trap tied on. Gonna switch through some colors and types of rattles, see what's working, seeing what's not. Got a bunch of other stuff tied on. And uh, we're gonna see if we can catch some fish. I've already caught one small one, but uh, we're hoping for a three plus today. Um, some great fish in here. Um, and hopefully we get one. Let's go get them. There's one. There's under the dock. Got him. Well. Don't worry guys, I know what I'm doing. I'm a, I'm a professional. Alright. Alrighty, a little recap on how I caught that fish. So if you guys see that dock right there, I threw my fluke right up to it and a little fella inhaled it. Nice. I, I don't know, man. Some, some, something about the fluke in the, in the fall, it just works. I don't know what it is, but it's just, it just works for me. Like last year, I know I didn't shoot a lot of videos in the, in the fall, but this little fluke, man, it, uh, it catches them. Up a little more. There we go. Hoping there's another one under there. A bigger one too. You know, we love to catch our big ones. You know, I did it, I jerked it a couple times and the little fella came and gobbled it up. Hoping there's another one under this dock. There's always fish on that dam. I don't have a drop shot tied on, but I do have a Demiki rig tied on. And I do like throwing Demiki rigs. I don't know how deep it is here, so I'm gonna throw this a little more, a little shallower. Oh, might have been a bite. Let's give the fluke a break for now. Let's see if I can get any. Let's 
see if anyone wants a juicy Demiki rig. Ah, oh, great. Just great. There we go, something. Perch. Watch, the second I touch him, he's gonna flame his gills and everything. There we go. <laughs> Ow! See, that's why they're a pain in the ass, because they always spike me. Ugh, that one I felt more than others. Second, they're on hooks, they go crazy. Ooh, had something, I think. There's a fish. That's a bass. Get up on it here, buddy. Hey, that's the biggest one of the day. On the Mickey. Hey, calm down there, Buster. Hey. Hey. Wow, this one is pissed off. I mean, to be honest, I'd be pissed off too if I just got my ass handed to me by a little bait fish. <laughs> Alright, get that out of him. Alright, nice. Little bassy. Deep weeds, man. It's the name of the game. Every time. They're gonna go for those deep, they're gonna be in those deep weeds. Bet there's more in here. I'm feeling devious, fellas. You already know what time it is. <sighs> Big old mat. Well, this is actually a smaller size. What is this? I think this is a six inch mag. Out she goes. We're gonna catch a big one, it's gonna be here. Yup, I told you, I told you. If it's gonna be big, it's gonna be right here. On the mag. What did I say? Fish are feeding up on bait. Heck yeah, buddy. That's what I like to see. That was cool. There's nothing cooler than when you're bass fishing and you call your shots. Uh, I think that's... Mm. Could be one of our bigger ones for today. Thanks, buddy. Feeding up. The bass are feeding up. Can't beat the mag draft, man. And I guarantee there's more out there. Hoping we can find a big one. There. There we go. Something small. 
Oh, it's probably a perch. Hey, don't drag me in the weeds. Might be a bluegill, actually. No, it's a perch. Perch love jerk baits. Don't know why, but I do. Not making the same mistake as the last one. Just gonna shake him off. All right, well, this uh, color seems to be working here. Haven't really caught too many fish on this color so far. Alrighty guys, it is around, I'd say three weeks later. Um, we're back here and uh, yeah, I just wanted to uh, get back out here because last time we didn't, I didn't do nearly as well as I wanted to and um, I didn't film an outro. So I'll just film an outro after um, this. We'll combine the two, um, two videos together. Um, but yeah, we're here. It's windy. It is almost 80 degrees out. It's ridiculous. It's the beginning of November and it's almost 80 degrees out, which is awesome. So hopefully we can get on some fish. And uh, yeah, I'm going to stop talking. Let's go get some.